So Kev, this week, how have the lads been? Yeah, I mean, we had to build them up a little bit, early part of the week. Obviously, Sunday was a difficult difficult result for us, and the second half performance wasn't quite what we wanted. Um, and listen, as soon as they went down to 10 men in that game, that, that seemed to lift them, and, and, it, and it, um, it made it harder for us, to be honest, for, for, for whatever reasons. Uh, we found it difficult to break them down. Um, so the early part, we've been trying to build them up, um, and get ready to go again. We've said it before, dust ourselves down and go again. But it's been, you know, today the training was excellent. Um, but let's make sure we now turn it into a performance and some points. So without giving too much away, what kind of things have you been working on with the lads this week? Well, just trying to get a little bit of spirit, trying to get a bit of a buzz about it. And it's that stage of the season as well now where they, they, they do need a bit of rest. But it's kind of been difficult because the results haven't quite gone as we would have liked, it's difficult to give them rest. But so we've come, brought them in and done a few little bits and pieces with them in terms of training, just making sure the recovery is right, and uh, and just keep them mentally focused as well. We've gone through the details of last weekend's game, uh, and just keep them keep them mentally mentally focused and mentally strong because over the last seven games, you know they've had some real knocks. You know these late goals, it takes a lot out of players, uh, but they need to keep believing in what they're doing. You know, and uh, like I say, second half against Notts County wasn't good. Um, but they need to keep believing, and, and in terms of all the other performances, have been decent. You know, and so so let's hopefully, hopefully we can we can do something on Saturday now. Because a lot of football that you have been playing has been positive. It's been good going forward. Scored some great goals. So there's still a lot of good stuff to take, isn't there? From the yeah, it is. Honestly, it's it's, just, it's it's easy to say. It's them. The points total isn't what we wanted. Uh, but performance-wise, it has been good. Listen, barring probably maybe patches of the Accrington game and the Notts County game, you know, we'll you know we'll have to we take that take that on the chin. Um, but it's it's just so important that these players are positive now going into the game. You keep believing in what they're doing because you, I think everybody who's watched these games know we should have had a lot more points on board. Um, so we'll be we'll be trying to instill that belief in them and keep and keep it going, keep going, and uh, hopefully something will turn for us. And let's hope the fans are keen to hear about injury update. Is there anything you can tell us about? We've got a few coming back. A few coming back. We've still listen at this stage of the season. There's people that are missing little bits of training, so we need to constantly keep analysing them. But it's really, really pleasing that there's a few lads coming back into training again. Now we've got Pierce, uh, Pearson coming back in. Jack Taylor's are likely coming back in as well. Jamie Stevens likely coming back in. So you know they're big, big players for us as well. Big voices, big characters in the dressing room. So. You know, hopefully, if we can get them back sooner rather than later, it will it will be like signing some new players for us. With the weekend approaching, Cheltenham, how are you preparing your team for that? What do you expect from them? Well, we want the sort of performance that we've been having previously. You know, particularly against your Portsmouth and your Cambridges, that that sort of performance. And you know, I've tinkered with the shape, so we're still looking at that. Um, but no, I just want to, I want that enthusiasm. I want that energy. Uh, I want to be creating chances and keeping it tight at the back. Um, so hopefully, like I say, the crowd. I think certainly in them games they recognise that, you know, those two home games, um, and, and you make sure that we, if we get in front, we show a little bit of nous with it as well, um, and go on to get to to uh, to get the points. But I do know I've watched these a few times now, and I know they're down the bottom of the league, but they're fighting for their lives, and it is going to be a tough game. It's going to be a very very tough game, and it will be a tight game. From you. Personally, coming in midway through the season, like you said, you've inherited a squad that maybe you haven't had time to shape. How tough has it been for you to get into the rhythm, like you said, to find the right players, to find the, the way you want to play? Yeah, it, it can be difficult, to be honest. And I've got I've certainly got my, the principles of what I want to do, and I'm going to be sticking by them. And I think people have seen that. We're generally trying to get the ball down. We're trying to pass it. We're trying to be creative and pleasing on the eye as well. But equally, I do know we need to win games with that as well. So there's, there's no there's no doubt in that, and that is the bottom line of it. Um, but in terms of getting, so I'm getting, I'm really getting there now. I'm really getting there. In terms of obviously early on as well, you're making substitutions, and I had it, didn't know all, uh, all of those players. So now that's, I'm, I'm getting more of an understanding who can come on and do what. Who in terms of their training load, what they can train and be at their best at the weekend, and who's now maybe looking looking a bit jaded and maybe needs to come out. So all all them things they do take time, um, and I, I, feel, I feel that I'm, I'm getting there with them now. When it comes to the fans, I know they're quite disappointed after the Notts County games. What would your message be to them with the Hive you know, returning to action this weekend? What would you say to the fans? Yeah, well, what I'd say is this, everybody here is working at utmost. I'm working, you know, I'm so, I'm so proud to be the coach at Barnet. Um, and, and, I'll be, and I'm working as hard as I possibly can to make sure we turn 
some of these performances into into the points that we, we should deserve. Um, so just just keep back in back in the lads, um, and hopefully it will turn. And once we get that result, then um, then you know uh, we can we can go on a little run.